السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ضمن محاضرات الطفيليات التابعة إلى موديول Productive System Module هو محاضرة طفيليات Trichomonas Vaginalis تم ذكر جنس Trichomonas سابقا في موديول Gastrointestinal Tract و تناولنا نوعين من هذا الجنس اللي هو نوع Trichomonas Tinax و Trichomonas Hominis اللي كانت متواجدة في ال Gastrointestinal Tract أما بما يختص لموديول ال The Productive System Module فراح نأخذ نوع Vaginalis لجنس Trichomonas Objectives Identify common name of reproductive system parasite Name of disease Geographical distribution And habitat Describe the morphology and internal organelles of the trophozoite Understand the mode of infection Describe the life cycle Discuss signs and symptoms of the disease in women and men. Discuss the complications of the disease in women. Explain the methods of diagnosis. Describe the treatment. Define prevention and explain it. These are the objectives of our lecture. Trichomonas vaginalis is an anaerobic flagellated protozoan parasite and the causative agent of trichomoniasis. It is the most common pathogenic protozoan infection of humans in developed countries. The estimates for North America alone are between 5 and 8 million new infections each year. Its habitat in the reproductive and urinary system of people. It is obligatory parasite that can't live without close linkage with vaginal, urethral, or prostatic tissues. Infects squamous epithelium and high incidence of symptomatic infections is seen in women. Zinc and other inhibitory substances probably inhibit their growth in men. في تجارب على هذا الطفيلي ضمن الكالتشر وجدوا أن استخدام الزنك بتراكيز عالية تؤدي إلى قتل هذا الطفيلي Natural flora keep the pH of the vagina at 4 to 4.5 and this discourages infections Once established it causes a shift toward alkalinity pH 5 to 6 which encourages its growth. Morphology of Trichomonas trophozoite. ذكرنا أنه هذا الطفيلي هو ضمن طفيليات البروتوزوان. الطفيليات كما مر ذكرها سابقا تقسم إلى طفيليات البروتوزوا consist from single cell or متازوا consist from multi cells. This organism can survive for up to 24 hours in urine, semen, or even water samples. Multiplication done by longitudinal binary fission. It has a pure shape with four anterior flagella in the anterior portion and the fifth flagellum extend posteriorly. The fifth flagellum, the sound of the fourth, which is the most important from the left side. The interaction of this sound with the gyrar of the lumen will be shaped by the interaction of the gyrar-motorized angulating membrane. 
عن طريقة تكون حركة الطفيلي أسرع ارتباط الغشاء المتموج وما يعطيه الدعامة والإسناد هو عبارة عن الكوستة rigid cord attaches undulating membrane to the cell membrane and gives undulating membrane support هذا الundulating membrane اللي هو ذكرنا متكون من 50 flagellum attaches with the cell surface شكل هذا الغشاء المتموج أشبه ما يكون بال الزعنفة fold like a fin وذكرنا أن ما يسند هذا الغشاء المتموج هو عبارة عن تركيب يطلق به كوستا نأتي إلى تركيب آخر اللي هو الخيط المحوري أو القلم المحوري الأكسوستايل هذا هو الأكسوستايل It is a sheath of microtubules arises from bases of flagella sometimes projecting beyond the end of the cell to end at a pointed tail Exostyle runs down the middle of the body and ends in a pointed tail. Exostyle may be used for attachment to surfaces and may also cause the tissue damage seen in trichomoniasis infections. While this dark structure is a nucleus, we can see large rounded or ovoid nucleus near the anterior pole هذا الطفيلي بصبغة قمزستين ممكن ملاحظته بهذا الشكل In this image we can see purple structure called hydrogenosomes which is full with hydrogenase enzyme that reduce drug activity this image of the parasite with the using of normal saline life cycle لغاية الآن طفيلي تراكوموناس بكل أنواعه له فقط طور التروفوزويت or vegetative stage الطور الخضري أو الطور التغذوي معظم البروتوزوا لها طور التروفوزويت وانتقالها من شخص لآخر يكون عن طريق طور الكيس سيست ستيج لكن هنا في هذا الطفيلي لا نلاحظ وجود سيست ستيج وإنما فقط وجود الطور الخضري التغذوي نلاحظ ذكرنا انه المالتيبليكيشن دان باي لونجيتودينال باي نرفيشن انفكتيف ستيج از ذا سيم دايجنوستيك ستيج ويتش از تروفوزويت ستيج مود اوف ترانسميشن كاملي سبريد ثرو سيكشوال كونتاكت وذ فاجينال اور يوريثرال ديسشارجز اوف انفكتيد بيرسونز Transmission of organisms via artificial insemination of infected cryopreservation process of a human semen is also possible. ممكن أيضا يكون الانتقال عن طريق التلقيح الصناعي باستخدام المني المحفوظة بالتبريد اللي تكون تحتوي على هذا الطفيلي. Non-sexual transmission can be occur. But rarely. Observed in cases involving wearing contaminated moist underwear or swimming in water pool that contain this parasite. As we say, this parasite can 
be effective for up to 24 hours in water sample. More than 160 million people worldwide are annually infected by this protozoan. About 20 to 40% in women and 15% in men. Signs and symptoms. Incubation period takes about 4 to 28 days. Incubation period is the period between entering the pathogen till appearing signs and symptoms of disease. Signs and symptoms of disease in women ranges from asymptomatic to mild irritation to extreme vaginitis. Asymptomatic in most cases about 10 to 50 percent include vulvovaginitis, vaginitis, purulent vaginal discharge, leucorrhea. This image by uh, endoscopic endoscopic image of the patient's vagina we can see the inflammation of vagina and the whitish discharge leucorrhea caused by trichomoniasis unpleasant smell and strawberry cervix Punctate hemorrhages in mucosa include vaginal epithelium fiery red and inflamed, dyspareunia, urethritis, include dysuria, and increase the frequency of micturition. Signs and symptoms in men usually asymptomatic in about 50 to 90 percent. Signs and symptoms include non-gonococcal urethritis, pain during urination or ejaculation, testicular pain, purulent mucoid discharge, epididymitis, prostatitis, and superficial penile ulcerations. Complications in women include preterm delivery, low birth weight, and increased mortality as well as predisposing to HIV infection, AIDS, and cervical cancer. Laboratory diagnosis samples in women include vaginal discharge and endocervical specimen, while samples in men include urethral discharge, semen, and prostatic fluid. Methods of examination by microscopic examination, culture, antigen detection by using of ELISA, molecular diagnosis by the using of polymerase chain reaction which is highly sensitive and specific. Microscopic examination by the using of normal saline which is the wet mount method. It is easy and useful. About 80% sensitivity in symptomatic females. We can see this parasite with jerky movements. Or we can use Acridine orange stain. It is rapid and accurate method. Sensitivity same as wet mount. Or we can use direct fluorescent antibody staining by the using of fluorescent microscope. It is rapid and more sensitive method. While the using of culture is the gold standard, more sensitive, we can use media diamonds medium and kefirberg medium contains yeast extract horse serum or human serum and antibiotics observed for seven days culture usually positive after 48 hours you used in patient with suspected trichomoniasis but wet mount is negative treatment Infection is treated and cured with metronidazole 2 grams orally in a single dose. If treatment failure occurs, 
the patient can be treated with metronidazole 500 mg orally twice a day for 7 days. It is highly effective. We can use tinidazole 2 grams orally in single dose, which appears to have a higher success rate. Medication should be given to any sexual partners as well, because they may be asymptomatic carriers. If this treatment is unsuccessful, then tinidazole or metronidazole 2 grams orally daily for 5 days is prescribed. Prevention through detection and treatment of both partners, avoidance sexual contact with infected person, and use of condoms. هذه محاضرتنا لهذا اليوم تناولت طفيلي Trichomonas vaginalis التابع لموديول Reproductive System Module السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته